Is the late night shift with DoorDash and Uber Eats actually worth it? Today, I'm gonna be dashing through the late hours of the night to see if it's actually worth it. Let's go! Oh, it's windy. We're getting right into it. It is currently 8 p.m. We're going until 2 a.m. We are doing the late night shift. Got this order to start us off here at 8 p.m. Starting off strong. I already saw a girl fall into a bush and it's currently 8, 10 p.m. People are crazy, man. All right, just drop that off. Who the hell do you think you are, D-bag? I don't know why he thought he could sit there. <laughs> Yo, okay. But just got, hello, we need light. There we go. Just got this offer here for Uber Eats and then it's like, I'll give you another. My hair's all jacked up, I apologize. I just got a haircut, I'm sorry if I look like a freak. My God. Ugh. Unfortunately, D bag needs to be used because the other bag is in use. And yes, thanks to this person for tipping five dollars, saying for therapy for me and D bag. Um, we went and we made no progress, of course. And for those of you who are new, uh, this is D bag. It's not my wife or my anyone. It's just this insulated bag. It's a, it's a it's not real. This is not how I should be spending my Friday nights. <laughs> All right, currently 50 minutes in, and as far as I'm concerned, I'm at a little bit over $22. I don't know if any of the Uber Eats tips got added on. That'd be freaking great if they did. But just got this offer here. It's pretty solid taking me back into the action. This took me a little bit out of the ways, and this is bringing me right back in. We like that. All right, just pulled up to the Wawa, and the entire drive over here, I was tailgated by a cop. I'm like, dude, I'm not gonna go faster. I don't know what he wanted from me. That's so bright. I just wanted to be able to see my face, but just picked up this offer. It's it's solid $15 for 30 minutes. We'll take that all day. Taking us out of the zone, but it's on Uber Eats, so zones really don't mean anything. But we are still looking to make $120 by 2 a.m. It's currently 9.30 and we are looking good. Oh, somebody's cool. Oh, wow, that actually was a cool car. All right, D-Bag's turn to shine. in and out of that store in three total minutes. <clears throat> Juicy. All right, before we even dropped off the last order, we got this offer taking us back into the college town of Westchester, where hopefully there's more money and more restaurants that stay open late, but I have had no downtime and that is beautiful. All right. Yeah, okay, D-bag. How could this happen to me? No. To my last customer, if you're watching this. Oh, I forgot your chocolate bar. It fell out. Get an RIP Zach's Hershey bar in the chat, please. Next up, we got this Applebee's offer. This is redemption for Zach. 
who is without a Hershey bar. Poor fella. Three hours in and we are cruising. We should crush the goal. This is how much we're at. Again, Uber Eats has not finalized the tip, so I don't know, but we haven't had any juicy offers, but the amount of money we've made so far, juicy. This might not be the sexiest offer in the game, but we actually had a slowdown for about six minutes where I didn't get an offer, so I was like, you know what? I'll take it. Not a soul on the road, and things have slowed down significantly. Guess we're taking these orders now. This is the ultimate DoorDash music right here. Finally got a solid offer. However, right before this, I completely ruined everything. I uh, accidentally accepted a balls order and I had to unassign it because obviously I didn't want it. And now my completion rate is a 94% and you need 95 to be top dasher. So it is like the second to last day of the month. All right, four hours down, this is the total we are at. We are getting closer and closer to $120. This is the offer we just got taking us back towards the zone we were just in prior to this, but whatever. I mean, come on. Even D-Bag knows, 20 minutes to make $10. Easy freaking money. And the best thing about door dashing right now at this time is there's no one else on the road. Or should I say Uber eating? There's no one else on the road. It's officially 12.50. That last offer took 15 minutes to make $10. Just got this, wherever it is on the screen, going back into the zone we originally started in. We like that a lot. Yikes, turn your brights off, son. My gosh, I'm blind. Oh, we got this add-on too, a little, little extra dollarage for only a couple extra minutes, not too bad at all. It's 1 a.m. I don't know why I thought the lobby's got to be open. One main issue of doing late nights is a lot of the times the lobbies will be closed, so you have to go through the drive through And if there's a line, you're screwed. All right, you got your food now. Pull ahead, please. Uh, I have a Uber Eats pickup for James. Second window, buddy. All right, thank you. Gotcha. Just picked up this offer. Uh, something crazy just went down. I saw a cop car bolt, and then another one come in and bolt off. It's freaking crazy, man. It's probably just some stupid bar fight between some guy that thinks he can beat up another guy who also can't beat him up, but then they both think they can beat each other up, but in reality, they both can't fight, but it just ends up being the worst fight you've ever seen in your entire life. That's most likely what happened. All right, just dropped off that last one, and I picked up this Papa John's order, and I know that Papa John's closed about an hour ago, so I'm gonna take that half pay and call it a freaking day for doing no work. I was wrong. I guess you wonder where I've been. All right, 158, officially calling it a night. 
After it was all said and done, I ended up making $150 in just six hours of work for an average hourly rate of $25. And in my opinion, I believe this was well worth it, but I would only do this on a weekend night, like Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. I don't believe it would be as worth it on a weekday night just because there won't be as many people that are up late ordering food. Again, every market is different, but nonetheless, make sure to subscribe for more DoorDash content. And bye.